we have seen your comments and today we are going to do another 24 hours challenge where we will be eating only ice cream so legit ah uh, today we will just be eating ice cream eh nothing else uh, it's really a challenge eh uh, because i'm always very hungry and i need to eat something um but this is a challenge so no choice let's go okay so we'll be walking around to find the first ice cream place that we see and we'll go in hey let's check out this place this is like a muslim owned ice cream shop eh? okay let's go So we have decided to order the durian chendo. Okay, so we actually have to wait outside. There's no sitting inside. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so this is a soft serve ice cream. It's eight dollars fifty cents, and it comes with the chendo flavor. And this is a durian here. Okay, it's melting already. I think we need to eat it. Okay, pasta, pasta, eat. You know why is it melting so fast? Because the weather is so hot now. Look at this. Surprisingly, right, it's not very sweet. Eh. I thought like chendo ice cream would be very very sweet. Yeah. I think this is really a localized flavor that a lot of locals will appreciate. And adding the durian, right, I think it's a good choice because it really elevates the flavor. I think we should faster finish this ice cream and go to the next one. Okay, so now I'm gonna bring you to my favorite ice cream place. One of my favorite. Okay. This is the place. Okay, so let's take a look at the menu and I will always order the hojicha soft serve on waffle. But the waffle is okay, right? Yeah, it's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, the hojicha soft serve waffle is here. So this ice cream waffle comes with a waffle, brownie, the hojicha ice cream, biscuit sticks and also some honey. I'm trying your favourite ice cream. I love hojicha and the taste of this right is really good eh? It's very siang. I'm eating with the waffle. Mm. This is really my favorite ice cream. It's really very nice because it's not very gelat also. So for this plate of waffle ice cream right, it's like ten dollars and forty five cents, including GST and service charge. So do you think it's worth it? I think it's okay uh. Yeah, I think it's like quite okay. So by the time you guys are watching this right, we will already be in Bangkok. So remember to follow us on our Instagram right, because we will be recommending you guys a lot of good stuff there. And also remember to subscribe because we will be posting a lot of new content. Oh my god, I saw the old school ice cream. See, got so many different flavors. And it's $1.30 each. Yeah, we got our one dollar and thirty cents ice, ice cream. cream. Okay, so I've gotten the raspberry ice cream, and mine is the um, peppermint chocolate chip. This is like really old school. We used to like always eat this in like primary school. Yeah, right? our childhood times. Mm. You know, since young, I like to eat this peppermint chocolate chip flavor, but a lot of people say it tastes like toothpaste. It's like very nice, what? Toothpaste. Yeah, I really love it. Eh. This ice cream really brings back a lot of memories. I remember after school, I would go to like the uncle and then buy this ice cream to eat. And also at home, right, when you hear the ring bell, right, you'll go down and buy this kind of ice cream, right? So I have one thing to say. But sometimes, it's the simple things that makes you happy. We are now over at town and look at the amount of people here. So earlier you brought me to your favorite place, right? Yeah. So now, right, I'm gonna bring you to one of my favorite. It's a newfound place, and I quite like the vibe there. Got some ice cream? Yes. I actually been here before once, and I quite like the vibe here. But for the ice cream, right, I think you have to try and let me know. These are the ice cream. So take a look. Which one you want? Okay, so there are too many choices. So Ben is gonna surprise me with his order. Oh, it's here. So this is actually an ice cream cake. For this ice cream cake, right, you have to wait for five minutes. So once five minutes is up, you can eat the cake. Okay, five minutes is up and do you order one more ice cream? Wow. So this is pistachio rose ice cream. Wow. Okay, so since five minutes is up, right, I'm gonna try the ice cream cake first. Mm, 
I can taste a very strong like mango sobe. So this small ice cream cake right is twelve dollars without GST and service charge. Yeah, I actually quite like it because I find it very refreshing, right? So the whole thing is actually ice cream. The top and bottom is like Berliner, and the middle part is the sobe. Okay, so the next ice cream is the pistachio rose. This one looks very very pretty. Look yeah. at the design here. <laughs> It's like bandong. You're right, like, it really tastes like bandong. Yeah. Right? So, you no know, other than this ice cream, right? There's one more below. So, this one is like pistachio ice cream. I'm trying it with the uh, matcha sponge cube. I like the pistachio one. Forgot to tell you guys the price for this one. This is $18 without GST and service charge. So, it's more expensive than the ice cream cake. Okay, so now I'm gonna say my quote already. Sometimes it's the expensive things that makes you happy. I also wanna say a quote. Sometimes it's not about the food, the price, or anything. It's about the company that matters. <laughs> So as you can see, the sky is getting dark and Ben, right, is very hungry now. Yeah, I think we should go eat something, eh, Ken? Cannot. Next stop, 7-Eleven. This is so interesting, eh. Let's try it. I've never seen this before. Okay, let's open this. Wow. wow. This is the another flavor. Okay, so this is our next ice cream. So mine is the banana flavor. And this is the uh, peach flavor. So this is called like Vinita ice cream. This is like $3 each eh. Yeah. It's quite expensive, right? It's just a very like normal vanilla ice cream with like chocolate here. Quite normal, but also like not bad eh. I'm going to compare the two different flavors. I think the peach one nicer there, but this is also a little bit sweeter as compared to this. I think this should be two dollars. I think it should be one fifty. <laughs> Thank you. See, got the coriander ice cream. Okay, so it's like 9 p.m. So it's really like a 24 hours challenge. Yeah, honestly, I'm a little bit sick eh. Because I've been eating ice cream for really like legit the whole day. Yeah, I'm just really very tired. Okay, so we've gotten the coriander ice cream. We thought it's really special. That's why we got this. It's my first time trying the coriander ice cream. And personally, I love coriander. Yeah, so um, I think it'll be okay. Cheers. Mmm. I love it eh. I really love coriander right but the first mouth when you put inside right my whole mouth really tastes like coriander because there are like um, coriander beads inside yeah it's really very special but the more you eat right actually it's like not bad we're still gonna go to like maybe one more ice cream place okay okay we are here but take a look at the queue it's a lot of people There are a lot of flavors here. I think we're gonna try the oolong lavender and also honeycomb. Honeycomb. Okay, so after a long wait, we decided to take away because the queue is too long. Yeah, it's always very very long here. Yeah. So we got two different flavors each. So mine is the honeycomb, which is our favorite of all time. Yeah. So this is only three dollar ninety cents. For mine is oolong lavender. This is really special, and I really like it. This is actually like four seventy. So it's like much expensive yes. than the honeycomb. This is like the premium flavor, right? Okay, let's eat our last ice, ice cream for the day. And for the honeycomb right, you can really see they have a lot of honeycomb inside this ice cream. Yeah. For the oolong lavender right, the lavender taste is actually very strong. So if you are someone that don't really like lavender, I think this one you might not like it. Yeah, it's true. I think the lavender taste is really strong. It tastes like the essential oil. Honestly, I had fun today. Although I was the one that complained a lot. No. Okay, so that's all for the video. So if you guys got any other 24 hour series that you want us to try, leave it down in the comment box below. Yeah, maybe you can try in Bangkok, you know. Remember to subscribe to us and click on the notification bell button so you get notified when we upload new videos. And also remember to follow us on our Instagram and TikTok. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye!